So I wanted to try this new segment out. I saw some other people doing it, and uh, I guess I just wanted to follow suit. So I saw this thing on YouTube a little while ago of uh, some drummers going through their stick bags. And uh, so I thought, hey, I might as well try that. So this is my version of uh, what's in your bag. So here's my stick bag. As a lot of you guys know that uh, I'm a proud endorser of Los Cabos drumsticks. I've been playing Los Cabos for over half of my playing career. And a few years ago, I was able to link up with them and, uh, and start this great relationship that I have with them. So, as of right now, you know, my stick bag is looking kind of bare. There's only about, uh, you know, five sets of sticks in there and some mallets for the softer cymbal swells and stuff. But, luckily enough, ah, look what came in today. So, I got a package today from Los Cabos. And uh, we're gonna open up and see what's added on to the, uh, the stick bag. So Los Cabos is a uh, drumstick manufacturer here in Canada, actually right here in the Maritimes, so Eastern, uh, Eastern Canada. And uh, I'm so happy to be with these guys. They treat all of their artists like absolute gold. They're so amazing to deal with up there. Family, uh, family run um, business, which is always something that's pretty uh, dear to me and my guys, um, because we really like the, uh, the tight-knit community um, with everybody that we kind of keep in the circle of, uh, of everything for the band. So right off the bat, they sent me some stickers because they know I love to plaster stickers on everything. I have my, my phone here so I can see the, uh, the camera. So, a bunch of stickers, which is awesome. I'll probably use these things all up within a couple days. Give some to the guys. Sometimes I like to leave them on the merch table and stuff for the people that, you know, want to come out and chat drums after shows, which I'm always happy to do. Awesome. So, I got some brushes. So these are the, the clean sweep brushes and we've been doing a lot more acoustic uh, shows because of this pandemic. Um, rooms can only have half capacity here in Nova Scotia and we're not really allowed to go anywhere else. Um, so since it's only half capacity we can't really throw in the full live show because there's not enough really people in there to deaden the sound and we like to play really loud. So these things are going to come in nice and handy for uh, for the acoustic performances, and we actually have a few of those coming up too, so if you go on to uh, the Facebook page or Instagram or the website or anything like that, you'll see some of those uh, acoustic performances um, coming up. Really excited to use these. Also, once again, staying with the acoustic performance side of things, so I got some bamboo, or, uh, bamboo, bamboo um, slapsticks. Uh, once again, more of the acoustic performance style thing just because, uh, you know, drumsticks are loud, uh, especially with how big and loud my cymbals are. These things are definitely going to come in handy. That's super cool. I like the orange. A lot of companies, um, you know, will stick with black or sometimes red and all that. The orange is a, a nice touch, easy to find. Other than that, I got some new multi-sticks, which is good because my other ones are starting to get eaten away. So these things are really cool. These are the Lost Cobbles multi-sticks. So you'll see right on them, they have felts. So that way when you're doing like cymbal swells and stuff, um, you get a nice, uh, nice sound and nice decay from them. But then on the other side, you actually have your standard drumsticks, which is good. So it's easy to do a quick swell, then change the sticks around and, and play until you can grab a, another pair of sticks or just play the rest of the song with these. So there's another thing that I don't, uh, I didn't actually have yet, which I actually have some now, which is really cool. I'm sure the guys are going to be trying to get some of these for me as well. But I got sent some uh, Los Cabos keychains, which are really, really cool. They're little, the tips of little drumsticks, they have their little, you know, Los Cabos logo on them. 
trying to aim it here for the camera. I'm not good at this. So I got a, quite a few of those. And then, wow. I got about three bricks, which is about uh, 12 pairs in a brick. So I guess 36 pairs of sticks. This will keep me going for a little while. So, and these are the sticks that I play. These are the uh, 5A, these are red hickories. Um, red hickories I find stand up to pretty much any player. Um, I think I've only ever broken, maybe, like actually broken, less than five sticks, probably with Laws Cabos. I mean, they do get chipped away and stuff uh, for uh, over time of playing them. Um, you can't really seem to break these things. I don't suggest going out and trying, but... Uh, I mean, I hit drums hard, and um, yeah, I have a hard time breaking them, so. And these are the sticks I play. Once again, I'll grab my camera. So you can see the Laws Cabos, and you see my signature on them, which is something really, really cool that the guys do for me. There we go. There's it in view. So that's the signature I put on a lot of my uh, my own um, photos and my own uh, other endorsements and stuff that I have um, on drum heads and stuff like that as well. So that's basically what's in the uh, that's what's in the box. Wow, there's more keychains. <laughs> yeah, the guys are definitely gonna be getting some of those for me. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, I'm going to load up my stick bag. I'll take a photo. I'll put it up on Instagram and the other socials and stuff like that. And I'll put a link to uh, the YouTube channel because this is a brand new YouTube channel. I decided to try to um, get together, as you can see from uh, some of the other videos that are probably on here now. Uh, and we're going to see how that goes. I mean, you've got, you got to find a way to pass time during you know a global pandemic. So. Um, I'll post some photos up on Instagram and stuff, and you can see the stick bag basically as it is now, and once it gets all filled up. So, thanks for joining me, and uh, yeah, stick around, watch some other videos, and uh, we'll see you later.